I'm here in Native File mainly to teach you some interesting things like uh, mathematics, some recipe secrets, and uh, many more. I really like Native File too. They help me a lot. I used to teach mathematics from elementary level to college level. My passion is only two three. So today I would like to share with you the real basics of algebra. Do you know what number line is? Here there's a line. Can you see this line? Below the line you can see so many numbers that is at the zero in the middle and uh, positive numbers with the right of the zero and negative numbers with the left of the zero. This is what number line is. Okay. Then regarding addition you can see 1 plus 1. What is 1 plus 1? 2. Yes. Everybody knows that. Then 2 plus minus 1. Here, we are, you can see one plus sign here. This plus sign denotes addition. Okay. And if I am adding between a positive number and a negative number, you have to subtract. So, plus 2 and plus minus 1 is equal to, I told you, you have to subtract. So, 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, the question is, which sign you will put, put in for the answer? You can put the sign of the bigger number. Here, which is the bigger number? Here, 2 is the bigger number. So, positive 2. So, uh, the answer will be positive 1. Okay. Similarly, the next one that is minus 3 plus 2. We are going to add different sign numbers. That is negative 3 and positive 2. So, what you are going to do? You have to subtract. Yes. So, 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. So, what's, which, what's the sign? is um, the sign of the bigger number. So here, which is the bigger number? 3 is the bigger number and 3 is having negative sign. So your answer will be negative 1. Okay. Finally, you're going to add same sign numbers. That is negative 6 plus negative 6. So if you're having same si sign number, then you have to add. Okay? So, 6 plus 6 is equal to 12. So, regarding sign, yes, negative because you can see only negative sign here and sign will be negative. So, answer is minus 12. So, this is all about addition. Regarding subtraction, carefully listen. Okay? 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. Yes. So, I'm taking this example. Okay. Minus 3 minus plus 2. In this case, I'm going to have some tricks. You just exchange the sign. Can you see this minus here? You just exchange the sign with this plus. So, you can see minus 3 plus minus 2. Can you get me? Minus 3 plus minus 2. So, the answer will be minus 3 plus minus 2. Yes, the answer is minus 5. Why you got the answer like that? Because you already know the addition rule that is minus 6 plus minus 6. So, I just exchange this sign, that is minus 3 plus minus 2. This is how you, s you used to uh, deal with subtraction. So if you exchange, the thing will change to addition. And you can finally do. And do many things as you do in the next hour. It's now time to leave. Bye-bye.